So I want this truck to last forever, but the economy wants it to go away. And that's heartbreaking because there's like hundreds of years of technology just in this brake assembly. Here's something cool. We're looking at the rear drum brakes, but the drum is inside of here. So there's two sets of brakes on this uh, wheel. And then you have the regular disc brakes. You're looking at a totally worn out pad um that's the original which is wild 160,000 miles i wore this one down a little too far um you get to hear the sound of a singing brakes before this happens so you got pad one pad two they make a sandwich and then this ceramic material which is an amazing invention by itself slide this and make it very 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 hot against the metal for years and it doesn't degrade it just gradually wears down so anyway um if you wear that down too far that's when your disc see this is how it's supposed to look when it's under normal wear conditions and then this is how it looks if you've gone too far now you're rubbing steel against steel can you see that see this is magnificent it will tell you even if you need to change this part Built into the part permanently, minimum thickness, TH, 16 millimeters. See, we reached metric and precision, and let's see what we've got, because I messed this one up. 16.48. So what that means is, no, I wouldn't just keep this on there. What we used to do is we'd take this to the auto shop, and they would turn the rotors. Turning the rotors gives you a brand new smooth surface but it'll remove just a hair it'll probably 0 0.2 0 0.5 millimeters off of that and then oh i'm sure it's just not within spec anymore because you because we wore out only one side that's not okay here's another neat thing the box where you get your new brake pads gives you uh, instruction on breaking them in you're conforming that uh, ceramic surface to the disc surface with 30 decelerations from 30 to 5 aggressively. Well back to what I was going to say before there's usually a thin steel tab on one or both of these brake pads that reaches out and then see that that point that extremity right there will scratch against the steel disc once this pad has worn down a certain amount and then it plays the song of its people. So this mechanical thing does the sensing of the depth of the pad. It does computation against the minimum depth allowed. And then it does the singing of the song as a user indicator. All in this.